Hey guys, um, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a dead mouse head in Cinema 4D. Um, if you like the video, you can subscribe for more like it. And so here it goes. So you're going to need to open Cinema 4D and this is what we're going to be going for right here. And here's the, like, the official dimensions of it. Um, they're posted by Dead Mouse, so that's what we're trying to make it look like. And then you're gonna want to make a sphere, and then you're gonna make it uh, 300 radius and 100 segments. And you're going to rotate it, so it's facing like that. And yeah, just 90 degrees, and the front's going to be right there. What you're going to do, you're going to make it editable, editable by pressing C, then go to this. And now you're going to want to select the mouth. You're going to want to make it as close to 50 degrees as possible. You select it. And once you let go, you can press Shift. And you'll select it again. And yeah, so you just cover the whole thing. And it doesn't have to be perfect. In this video, I'm just kind of trying to show you and give you an idea. If you make a mistake, you can press Control, then click. And so you don't have to redo it. Alright, so there you go. Just make sure you have all the right things selected. You're going to right click and say Extrude. And then. I usually do it negative 14. That's just the best, in my opinion. You can do it whatever you want. You're going to want to use the color you want. Put it on there. And then this part's kind of tricky. It takes a few tries. Have to select the right part. Okay. Okay, here we go. Um so yeah, it's kinda of starting to take shape with its mouth. You're going to add eyes, so you're gonna need a sphere to kind of position it general area, then make it seventy-five uh, radius, and then rotate it so you can see an X in the middle because that's we're going to make the X. You're going to position that how you want it. You press Control C and then Control V, and then just change that from a negative to a positive, and that should flip it. It's just a little close, so I'm going to delete it. Control C, Control V, and then change it to negative. Alright, we'll just go with that. And then just rotate this one so you can have an X in the middle. Alright, and then you're going to press C on both of them. Again, to make them editable, and then Click on that and make the X. There you go. Put the color you want on it. Again, this is a tricky, it's hard to get to work. So there you go. It takes a few tries. And then you can copy and paste the eye and then just reposition it or just do it again like I'm doing. Okay, sorry this is taking so long.
Okay, there we go. And just get it exactly how you want it. And you can add glow to the color too, I forgot to tell you. So it's eyes will glow. Then you'd want to make a cylinder, then change it to 10, and then a radius of, oh, I need to change it to 250. So yeah, there you go. You want to go to cap and then turn on and fill it. So it has rabbit ears. That's that's how dead mouses are. You should position them how you want. Okay, and then color on. Oh sorry, I'm just Leave this. You should copy and paste it, and then reverse the coordinates so it, the whole thing's symmetrical. It's a little too thin, so I'll make them bigger. All right, that's how it looks. Now they need to be angled back, so I have to find the right one to angle. There we go. Alright, and they should be back 15 degrees because that's how Dead Mouse does it. And yeah, that's just about it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.